Hello everyone and welcome back to Jam Exclusive. Today we are looking at how to install the uh, World Edit plugin for Bucket. So uh, assuming that you have all of this in a folder. So yeah, you've got all your servers set up, it runs okay. We are going to go to this link which will be in the descriptions, World Edit on Bucket website. Uh, it's basic, I'm just going to basically show you how to install this and how to use it. The very simple stuff, not because this uh, this plugin does go in depth. So uh, we're just gonna go up here, click on download, and then we're gonna download. Okay, so then we get the dot zip. We're just going to drag this into our plugins folder right there. So that's in our bucket plugins folder where our server is. Uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> We're just going to go in here and then we are going to open this file up. You can put this anywhere, it doesn't really matter. Sorry, that one on the screen. We're going to get the worldedit.jar, that's the very important one. You're going to find your folder, mine's called bucket on my desktop. You're going to click OK and then we close this and that didn't work. <laughs> going to extract to. Ah, sorry you need to extract it to your plugins folder there we go so it's in there and it should also be here there it is so I put that in the wrong place uh, so there you got the worldedit.jar in your plugins folder now you can just go ahead and start up your server and it should give you the log there we go just a second bit slow and it should say yeah enabling world edit the well whatever version you're using so now we're going to get on minecraft start us up just a second log on to your server okay so I'm on my server. Here we go. And uh, well, the basic, the first basic command in World Edit, you need to type a slash slash double slash, and then wand. You don't have permission. You need to give yourself op <laughs> first. So you need to go op your name. So I've op myself, and then you go slash slash wand. That will give you this wand, and it says left click, select first position. Uh, right click second position so basically what that means if I wanted to select this position here let me close a few windows it's a bit laggy one second yeah if I wanted to make uh, this four by these two blocks well it's just mark a region so if we wanted this region uh, to there if we wanted that this whole region as stone so it'll be along here along here along here along here so if we wanted this whole area as stone, yeah, we could left click on this block, that will say first position set, right click on this one, second position set, now you do slash slash set stone, and then there we go, so nine blocks have been changed. There we go, so uh, we've done that, uh, so I can build a house for instance, so I could do slash slash walls and then say stone my oh, box have been changed and then that will obviously do the area that I've done so nothing for instance but if I do this and stick that and that stand in the middle oh, it's a bit glitchy a few times there we go then we do slash slash walls and then our material then it has made walls on our region that we have set go in creative mode so there we go there's our walls uh, if you do slash slash and then it will enable super pickaxe which basically means in survival mode you can just destroy it's just a really really good pickaxe but if you do slash slash help then it will give you all the commands uh, to do with well dead it so you know you've got slash butcher and that will kill all the mobs you know, you've got, uh, you can, I'll show you how to copy stuff right now. So we see our little uh, place here. We'll just find 
right behind corner, uh, left click, and then right click the other corner, and then wherever we want to stand, do slash slash copy, enter, and it says blocks copied, and then say if I wanted, what is that? If I wanted my house over here next to that, a fail, then so that was standing over there. If I want now, if I want to paste it here, I do slash slash paste. There we go, and that that will copy every single thing inside. If you've got a sign on the wall with writing on it, it will copy. If you've got a chest with item inside, it will copy. It will copy every single thing. Uh, you can also do instead of the wand you can do slash slash p o s one that will select the first position if you don't want to use a wand then you could go here slash slash p o s two then that will you, you can just select region and if you want to set it to air so if you want to absolutely delete it this is quite a useful little thing <laughs> i suppose you do slash slash set zero that will set it to air and there we go it's gone um, you've also got the slash slash undo command, so if I want to get back my house, I do slash slash undo. There we go, I've got my house back. Um, we've got, you can s make a, s bleh bleh bleh. you can make a sphere. So if you do slash slash s p s p h e r e, then that will give us our help command for slash slash sphere. So if we do slash slash sphere, <laughs> we can type in our block. I want to make it glass. So we type in glass radius. I'm just going to put it five and five again. There we go. You, another useful command if you get stuck in a position like this, you can type slash slash t h r u, which is through, and then that will take you outside. So there we go. We've got our sphere. Very nice sphere. It makes it all for yourself. Very nice. Uh, obviously, you can make a massive one. Another useful command is uh, slash slash hcyl, which will actually make like a ring around you. So if I want a stone ring, I could put stone and then one and then one. Then you see it will make a tiny little ring. But then if I do slash slash hcyl uh, stone. If I want it 50 by 50 by 50, that means it'll be 50 width. I oh know, just 50 by 50. It'll be 50 and 50 tall. 50 wide and 50 tall. Do that. So I've got 14,000 blocks have been changed. There we go. I've just got a massive structure here now that will keep me safe from mobs. Obviously, now if I want a platform up here, I can do slash slash hcyl. Uh, stone one one and then there we go I've got a little platform up here safe from everything down there and if I wanted to get down I can do slash slash d e s c e n d slash slash descend then that will take me down here and same if I wanted to get up slash slash a ascend and that will take me back up so yeah world edit is a really really useful command if I wanted you know, it's make an aquarium for instance. Could go down. Slash slash set water. Yeah we go, I made an aquarium. Oh I could do slash slash set lava. Yeah, it's just an awesome, awesome plugin. And I highly recommend it for making big structures, everything like that. Uh if you want any other plugin that you want explaining or how to install or anything like that then just ask because yeah i basically know the plugin uh, so yes i hope you enjoyed this any questions just ask in the comments below and i will answer them as good as i can so thank you for watching subscribe whatever <laughs> see you later